was not expecting that. You. You're so tall. I know. <laughs> My name is Ryan, I'm 5'5", five five and I'm a pre-K teacher. But I like to tell people I'm 5'6", so it gives a bit of an advantage. What's the tallest you've ever dated? Like 5'8", five, 5'9". Five, it went okay, but you know what? It did not end the way I was expecting. Wow! <laughs> 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 How are you guys? Good. How are you? Good. 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 Um, well, I'm Cassie. I'm 21. I'm an esthetician. I like going outside. I like going to the gym. And um, I like funny guys. So Okay, okay. I'll try to be funny for you. <laughs> okay. No promises. Cool. Okay, we're doing a whole introduction. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Come on. I'm Izzy. Hi. I'm 23 years old. I live here and I'm an executive assistant at a production company. And I like I like a funny guy. Yeah. Okay. I like okay. funny guys. Everybody likes funny guys. We right? all like funny. <laughs> um, I'm Abby. I'm 21. I'm a student, and honestly, all I look for in a guy is that he's respectful. Yeah. Hi, I'm Hi. Amy. Um, I'm 23, and I just wanted to mention I am a nurse, wow. and I have ADHD, and I just can't compute. And I feel like you give that same vibe. I don't know. You walked in and said that you get distracted. So, uh, did I? Yeah. <laughs> Play it. Uh, I'm sorry, I get distracted. I'm Chase. I'm 25. Nice I am a barista. Nice to meet you as well. I'm very into music, uh, natural hair care, fashion. But yeah, funny, great, okay. and yes. Yes. <laughs> funny, funny is the whole thing I'm going for, I guess. Yeah. I'll try. Hi, I'm Monse. I'm 25 and I'm a singer-songwriter. Um, I'm Mexican-American and I feel like the vibes you gave are definitely like golden retriever vibes. <laughs> <so far>. mm, <laughs> yeah. yeah, 100%, 100%. We'll see, we'll see where this goes. What's a green flag that would make you look past a red flag? <laughs> Wait. Honestly, just if you're funny. If we're arguing and then you just like say something to make the banter go well, nah. we'll see. Okay. You would look past any of the other red flags if it's just funny. <laughs> it's funny. I mean, mayhaps. <laughs> Ooh. Like, if I could just really connect with that yeah. person and be able to mentally, spiritually, emotionally jive with them. I was gonna say, like, if they're emotionally mature enough to realize that they have uh, red mm -hmm. flags and work on it, then I can vibe with that. As long as they're willing to take accountability. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and a green flag for me is, I think, drive. There are no red flags that could surpass. If he murdered someone? <laughs> Whoa, he had drive. He had drive. Just not the kind That's you want. That's dedication. <laughs> yeah. Um, I feel like for me, it's someone who's weird a little bit, but not not in a bad way. A good kind of weird. Like I'll message someone first and literally just say squawk or something so like, like that. Or like it's just, they just like randomly just <laughs> scream. What is your red flag in woman? If you're not honest with what you want. Mm. You kind of like beat around the bush. Mm -hmm. They're not straightforward with it. Then I'm just like, all right, yeah. I'm just gonna move on. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't. I don't, I don't know. It's so Aww. hard. They're all so pretty. <laughs> yeah, I can't do that. I don't like this. I don't like making these types of decisions. This is difficult. Um, I'm gonna go with number one. So before she walks around the curtain, I need to guess how tall she is. I think she's five six. Oh, fascinating. Okay. Sorry. It's okay. Why I'm me? Just a bit. Why you? <laughs> um, I am not super like into the very down to earth spiritual type of thing. Okay. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Nice to meet you, though. Nice to meet you. Terrible. I feel like a straight up dick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to cry. Like, oh, oh don't cry. Don't cry. Don't cry. You're too pretty. Yeah. <laughs> I feel so bad. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna open up my fancy phone. Would you allow me to be passenger prince if we went out? Oh. Yeah. 
Would you let me ride in the passenger seat? Of course. Of course. Hand on the thigh is required. Hand on the thigh is always required. Okay. Hand oh, on the thigh. I'm always driving. I prefer to drive. Say less. I love driving. I like driving. I, prefer, so. I was going to ask, do you prefer the passenger seat? Yeah. I love being passenger prince. Mm, I love being there. taken care of. But do you have a car? I do. Okay. Then that's, that's fine. <laughs> What's the most embarrassing thing you've ever said or done in front of someone you liked? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> This was my first crush, and we were in his car. I finally confessed that I liked him. And he goes on this whole like spiel on how he pees in the shower and that I don't actually like him because he pees in the shower, and that's not hot. He was like, you don't like me, I pee in the shower. Oh, yeah. He, he tried to convince me not to like him. Because he peed in the shower? Yeah. I was, yeah. I was on a first date with a guy, and I ordered red wine, and I like get really shaky when I'm nervous and I accidentally spilled it all over him and he was wearing like a white top and then we never went on a second date. Oof. He like unfollowed me on everything too and I was like, ooh, okay. Okay, that's a red flag. Yeah. Red flag. His oh. look. <laughs> yeah, right? I have told a man that like I love his socks and he had sandals on. Yeah, I just was nervous. Okay, my experience was I went out on a date one time and like I met her and she was taller than I expected. And she looked at me and she's like, oh, you're a lot shorter than I expected. No. And then we went out, we had a good time, and then we kissed at the end, and then she said, I would love to go out with you, but you're too short for me. Oh, no. Like, oh, we're short. Yeah. No, but you're short, yeah, you're short. Pick up your crown. Yeah, no, right? <laughs> you deserve better. So that was pretty traumatizing. I was like, oh. It's hard because I vibe with all of them. Um, I'm gonna go with three and five. I'm guessing she's like six foot, like straight up. Do I give that vibe? Yeah. You would be correct. Let's go. Yeah. No, it's like model energy. Like exactly. she's so slim. She's so gorgeous. She's so gorgeous. Right? She's so gorgeous. Like, are you kidding? Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm go. And I'm five ten and a half, not six foot, but I am giving that. So she a... gives, like I love it. Oh, She's so tall. Thank you. Look at look at the size comparison. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Second person number five. Can you give us a guess of how tall you can feel? Five eleven. -ish. Okay. Hello. Oh. <laughs> if I release a song called Short King, you know who it's about. Sweet. Well, that, I don't know if that's a good thing, right? It's not. Oh. Ooh, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, we're cool, we're cool. Okay, okay. Going to the studio. <laughs> Heading to the studio. Bye, guys. Oh, and I tried to hug them. It was just like, I was hugging like their legs. I wasn't even hugging like their waist. So that was kind of a, an interesting experience. Um, what's your relationship with your family like? Are you guys close? I'm extremely close with my mom and dad. My brother and sister are both in different states, but we talk all the time. So we're super duper close. I think that family is extremely important, whether it's with your partner's family or with yours as well. What's your go-to comfort show? Uh, I recently just started watching Breaking Bad. Okay. Um, pretty solid. Right? Yeah, I know. Very good show. Are you a sitcom person? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I also like sex ed education, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's my favorite mm -hmm. yeah, show. Have you seen The Office? Oh, I love The Office. Yeah, that's yeah. the go-to. Michael, Michael Scott yep. is my favorite. Yep. Yeah. He's a king. He's a king. Right? <laughs> um, can I ask one stupid one and one more serious one? Yeah, you gotta shoot it. Um, okay, the stupid one is, would you rather have eight eyes or eight legs? Uh, legs. Legs, okay. Yeah, legs, yeah. Okay, I would say eyes. Where would you look then? Like, where are you? you like, if you were making around. eye contact with somebody and they had eight eyes. You're looking that's... at all the eyes. The eyes are just like in a row around your face like that. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Freaky. Okay, then the more serious question is, if you could have one food every day for the rest of your life, what would it be? Spaghetti pomodoro, because I'm Italian, so my dad mm -hmm. makes really good Italian food. So his spaghetti pomodoro is like, Delicious. It's my favorite. What role do you play in your friend group? The mom. I have like a bag like in my tote bag with just like 
tampons, deodorant, band-aids, like hairbrushes. I'm there whenever you need me the at your disposal. And everything yeah. like that. Yep. I'm definitely the jokester and the planner. Mm. So I like to make plans for everyone and make sure everyone has a good weekend. Um, and then also I just love to make everyone laugh. Okay. I'm silly okay. goofy. I would say I'm the communicator. I always try to make sure that everybody knows what's going on. If there's plans, I make sure everybody knows there's plans so we can all be invited, make sure we all can go to things. And yeah, that's my biggest thing. Just make sure we're all connected still. I need you in my friend group. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's yeah. make one. <laughs> um, number one. Five, six. Should I go up? Five. Higher. Eight, Higher. nine, Higher. ten, Higher. eleven. Higher. What? <laughs> Can I stand now? Surprise! <laughs> Surprise, Shawnee! Whoa! Surprise. I was not expecting that. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet Thank you. you. You're so tall. No. <laughs> It's a surprise. The, it's the boots. It's definitely the boots. I, I, I definitely right. swear if you took off the boots, we'd be the same, same height. We would. Yeah, my right? boots are like, yeah, my boots are like tight. Right? It was so nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you, you too. Good luck. Thank you. God, I'm going to go with number two. Okay, how tall? She's definitely like in the seven foot area. <laughs> definitely. We'll see. Yeah, let's do it. No way! <laughs> you were sitting on something. There's yes. definitely like a book, right? It was a little like platform seat. No <laughs> way! Nice to you. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely not a six look feet. You so tall. <laughs> yeah. You guys are short queen me over here. <laughs> we for sure. <laughs> How do you feel about being here? Yeah. Yeah. Great. Definitely taller than me. Uh, I'm gonna go with about five, six. I'm bad at this. Right, I'm wearing platforms. Oh, okay. Hi, nice Hi, to meet nice you. To meet you. Uh, I'm five three, but five five of these. Yeah. See, I should have worn. I know we could have been shoes. matching. Yeah, we could have been yeah. twins. Hey, I'm Abby. I'm Ryan. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. 21. 21. Last okay. year in uni, so. Would you guys be open to the idea of a first date? Yeah. Yeah, I would. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, for sure. Passenger <laughs> prints. Yeah, yeah, you gotta drive. <laughs> you, you could be my passenger prints. Let's do it. The short king was definitely a king. He's great. We're vibing. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I took these off and him and I measured and we're like the same height and that's perfectly fine with me. <laughs> I think she's awesome. I'm kind of excited to see if we go on a date and see if we can make it work. Definitely not something with red wine. No, you, red wine is okay as long as I wear like, like a, a different color. Shirt. Okay. Dark shirt, okay. dark shirt, okay. no white shirts. No white shirts. Have you ever been to Italy? Yes, I love Italy. So good, yeah. The one, Westfield? Yeah, yeah. The, and rooftop. Rooftop, rooftop only. Rooftop only, Yep. that's the way. 